5 reasons why you should buy the Adidas Forum Low 84 ADV skate shoe. First, the build in quality. They're not the same as GR Dunks that feels plasticky on hand. Maybe you will downvote me if you are a Nike Dunk fan, but let's be real, the materials of this guy, the Nike Dunks, it's not even close. I mean, take a look on that suede on the uppers. At the end of the day, we the consumers would benefit from the competition and let's just be open-minded. The ADV uppers are made of different shades of gray leather suede. They are soft and feels nice when touched. Not gonna lie, I'm also a fan of gum outsoles, which is pretty common for skate shoes since they are more durable. The level of quality is very comparable to a Nike SB Dunk, which is my favorite sneakers on Nike's lineup. Second reason would be the price. The ADV84 retails for 110 euros here in Europe. And if you want to compare it to its direct competition, it's going to be 10 to 20 euros cheaper. To me, that's a huge difference already, especially if you can get the spare on sale. The shoe came with no extra laces, unfortunately, unlike the SBs, which is pretty normal. But I really love the colorway of this pair, which is called Carbon Gray 4. A combination of four different shades of gray that can be seen on the shoe uppers and stripes. But the insoles is just okay versus the zoom air of SBs. The third would be the metal rings that are installed on the eye stays. I mean, the eyelets itself has the metal rings. And since I am a big fan of lace swapping, these are very helpful. And it reminds me a lot of the Trophy Room Jordan 1 Low. They have the same kind of styling. And since we're talking about lace swap, I also tried putting my black and gray SB laces just to have some fun and exploiting the metal rings. And kind of like it actually. I love styling them with my cargos to maintain that streetwear vibe. My fourth reason, although this is very subjective, I think the ADV84, especially this colorway, is a gorgeous sneakers. They can be worn so easy or you can pull them off super easily if you want to wear them casually. And I think that's the most important thing. If you want to buy sneakers, you need to like them first before anything else. And since there's not much hype on the ADV Forum Low, you can easily buy them for retail price. And actually, they came also with different colorways just in case you're interested. I'm always a fan of all gray sneakers due to its versatility. Also, it's very wearable all year round without worrying too much, unlike white sneakers. Lastly, this pair doesn't have the Velcro. So normally, if you are looking at the Forum Low 84, there's a Velcro on this area from here to here that covers a little bit the tongue. And some folks even hate it so much that they will try to remove it intentionally. Even though the tongue of the ADV is not as thick as SB's, it is still comfortable and feels a bit snug straight out from the box. Take note also that Adidas have some weird sizing, but ultimately I'm still wearing true to size in this Forum 84. Okay, guys, let me know your thoughts about the Carbon Gray 4 ADV 84. To me, Overall impression, a very good alternative to the Nike SB Dunk Low, especially the general releases sneakers. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this and as always, I will see you next time. Peace!